Hello, and welcome to Predetary Talk Time. I'm Tara. And I'm Brynn. So, we're going to be doing a series, Disposables versus Reusables. This isn't just, like, what you should pick. We're going to definitely address that, but we're going to be doing shape, comfort, absorbency, everything under the sun. So, if you like a pad, what you could possibly get, if you're really considering getting a reusable um, pads, you probably should watch this video. So we're going to be doing shape first. So the one we could find most comparable to this U by Kotex liner was this On Your Flow 6 inch liner. This is Dan Lore topped, very slim, very trim as you can see, very similarly shaped. So we're going to also be doing absorbency test between the ones that are similarly shaped. So that's a, you know, because these are very similar, like pack, you can't even feel you're wearing them. So that is the liner. And then the next one is the Always liner compared to the uh, Moon Pad. Yes. <laughs> so this is very similar in shape. They're both a little wider. This is a little bit wider, yeah, but like more curved. Yes. It's very similar. So we're also going to be comparing those. Then the Natra Care, because some of you do use Natra Care, so we thought, you know, we'll do that. So the reason I actually picked this is because this kind of bunches up in my underwear, so does this. So I picked two bunchy pads. If you like that, then you should maybe consider this. So, as you can see, yeah. you know, they're very it similar in shape. Like curls mm -hmm. up. Yeah. But anyways, they're very similar in shape. It's like long, mm -hmm. curved. Yeah, they're not too flared or anything like that. Mm -hmm. And then we're doing, this is a light flow, mm -hmm. a U-Bike mm -hmm. Kotex, by the Precious Star Pads. Mm -hmm. uh, they're not that similar in shape. I always said that this one really took away the moisture, and this is suede cloth popped. Yeah. So I thought we could compare these because they're very similar in length, and yeah. this one always felt like it gave me great protection. I don't know, they felt really similar in my underwear, so that's why I'm comparing those. So this is the, oops, <laughs> always regular. Let me just fix that. And this is a pink lemonade chat cloth pad. This is minky topped. And that one's a light flow, but yeah, this one doesn't hold, um, a lot, so we thought those would be good to come Yeah, they're regular, and they're actually really similar in shape. Yeah. It's a little narrower, but, yeah. yeah. And because it's minky, for our backup, we have a um, butterfly cloth pad, so just in case the minky doesn't absorb. Yeah. For our absorbency test. And then the Natural Care Ultra Pad compared to a Lady Pad, because they're both very similar in shape. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is a little thicker, though. And then, I can't remember the name of this pad. Do you know? The, it's like like the Lil, Lay, Lila, Laylee, Lila. I don't know. Lila. Anyways, Lila. these are like exactly the same shape. That little yeah. round, same length, seven inches. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna be comparing those because these are really, really similar. Yeah. And then, you by Kotex Tween. As I assume you are young, it's a heavy pad, yeah. and this is also Pretty a heavy pad. Really similar because it has that little curve to it. Yeah. Same length. Pretty much, yeah. Yeah, so we're comparing those. Oh, and then the Always Super compared to one of my own pads that I'm starting my business on Etsy called Recycle Pads. They're the same length. The same length. This is, gives you the same back coverage, so we're comparing those two. This is a heavy super pad. So we're going to be comparing those. These are both teaspoons, they're just not the same. Look what they do. So that's one teaspoon on the liner. Let's just check that. Oh, okay. So, so that the, one. You by Kotex is already leaked. The on your flow the back, yeah. is holding it all. So I definitely say the on your flow has like one. When you squish it, the water kind of comes up. So yeah, this one completely held it, not even leaking. You yeah. could definitely hold a lot more. So this one definitely won. Our winners are going to go over here. And then in the end, we'll show you the winners. Pardon, this one's a little stained. So we're going to do one teaspoon. This one did a lot faster than that one did. Yeah, this one, like, kind of sat on it. Took a little bit too. So let's not do it to yet. Let's see. All right, let's see. And this one, since it has, like, this, um, thing on the outside, it um, doesn't run off. Right, so, this yeah. one hasn't leaked at all. No, this one Very dry. dry. This is really dry. Yeah, this one, on. like, feels kind of Right, so let's go on to two. Get yeah. on this one. Ready? 
This one takes a okay, that one I don't know. That what that leaked and this is still holding it all and mm -hmm. hasn't run through the back. This one actually feels really, really dry. This one is, yeah, dripping off the edge. So, okay, so this one, I think, definitely won. And it's actually, it feels really, really dry. This is nylon backed, by the way. The one, the, um, on your flow is backed with fleece, and the party my pants had no water system layer. The yeah, so, okay. yes. Yes. Right. One. one. These are both kind of panty liner to light. Yeah, they're definitely a little more so, than panty liner. Mm -hmm. Two. I use this one as a light though when I used to use natural care. Alright, so after two, let's see how they're doing. Alright, yes, this one has a leaked. It's holding up, no leak. And um, yeah, it hasn't like hasn't spread leaked. all over yeah. the pad. And this hasn't like leaked through the back or anything like that. But yeah. Three. I just leaked off the edge a little bit. But now it's just leaking slightly. This one isn't leaking at all. So again, we have yeah, the, now it's leaking on the, edges. the part of my pants won that one again. And this is a liner I use as a light fit because it has a really great core. And do they both have purple on them? So <laughs> so it is a looking fabric, so that's why it takes up this water. Yeah, this so one quickly. knows it. Maybe for two. I really should Oh, I just purple on there. So. <laughs> okay. So that completely leaked off, and that's only two. Yeah. So... This one hasn't leaked at all. It hasn't yeah. gone to the back, even though this is microfreeze. So, again, the reusable like one. This one, as you want to show them in the camera, that one completely leaked. Yeah, now it's like this kind of. So now we're comparing the pink lemonade chop cloth pads to the always regular. This is a light, actually. <laughs> this is a regular, but yeah, yes. this really doesn't hold too much. So. They're very similar in shape, though. So. Really yeah, it has great <laughs> So, one. But Making absorbs pretty quickly, actually. Yeah, this one absorbs pretty quickly. Five. Right, let's just check them. So this is the this pink one lemonade chocolate pad. pad. And definitely isn't leaking. This one isn't leaking at all. And it, it pretty pretty dry. And the back is dry. So, um, and this is this is just for me before I spilled that off. So, I'm just gonna actually give this a second paper towel so we can actually see if it ever does leak. Okay, let's just cover that one up like this. Yeah, there. All right, six. That was the tenth, as you can tell. This one. This one we just stopped for a sec to do, uh, talk to my mother, and we looked back, and this had completely yeah leaked. running off the edge here, and now it's like not absorb, not um, this sticky. This one, even if I touch it to the paper towel, it's not leaking or dripping. Yeah, the edge of this is kind of dripping. This one is still completely oh, holding yeah. it, and this is only a light. That is a regular. Oh, yeah, so this one is kind of dripping now. Okay, yeah. That's so this one again, the reusable yeah, one, even though it was light. Wow. Now, one. So this one doesn't absorb as quickly as this one, but it's holding it all. It's like leaked slightly through the this wing. This one is a little bit on the edge. It kind of dribbles. Yeah, this off. one kind of leaked on the wing too. Gotcha. But uh, let's just keep going. Chat. So this is them now that they've had all that in there. Okay, this one is dripping off the wing now. This one is dripping when I hold it. So yeah, this one is like dripping off the edges. So. I'd say it's pretty much a tie. Yeah. But this one hasn't dripped off like the okay. edges. It's just dripping when I hold it. Yeah, this up one just like the whole thing is saturated now. But when I press this, the water just comes to the top. I'm not really impressed with the lady pad. It doesn't yeah, really this that one much. it kind of comes to the top too, and yeah, it's just fully saturated there. So. But this one could hold more. So yeah, mm. just don't. It doesn't absorb it super quickly when you put a lot yeah. on it all at once. So I've got to say this one did win though because it wasn't dripping off the edge. One. Look how quickly that absorbs because of that wicking stitch. And five. Okay. So I had to change this paper because I dribbled onto it. And I just yeah. Went, and yeah. this one, it kind of dribbled too. But, but that was um, me. I kind of went. <laughs> yeah. And this, these dribbles are from that. Yes. So um, this one is really dry, actually. This flannel is pretty dry. Like, yeah, it's really dry. And it kind of, like, it's fluffed up. <laughs> yes. And this one yeah. hasn't fluffed up at all. And it's not dripping at all. So yeah, really dry. Let's continue on. 
Ten. Oh, we both just leaked off the wing. Okay, now these, side. this one is like saturated and it's just leaking off the edge when I put it on. This one is only mecca and it hasn't leaked to the back at all, so. This one is, oh, mm -hmm. that one's like dripping on the bottom. There. Oh, okay, this one's dripping. Um, this one. This one is to its full capacity at ten. This one isn't dripping off the edge, but um, since it was saturated when I put new water on, it's just kind of dripping off the edge. But so, I want you to notice, look how fluffy that is. It is so fluffy. And then look how thin this is. I don't know if you could still be wearing this. At the, I don't know if you could still be wearing it. Like, so it's so thick. So yeah, that yes. the little up might be a little more absorbent, but pretty much. What do you think, Bryn? Could you actually be wearing it when it's that thick? I mean, yeah, so thick. And it's like, it's, this one is really jelly, so. Yeah, I would say pretty much a tie. One. And that absorbs. Oh, okay, I drip really that. <laughs> quickly. Sorry. It absorbs really quickly, as you can see. I'm just trying to be your body, smearing this in there. Smear, smear, smear. Five. And six. Okay, so let's see how they're holding up. I dripped there, so that's not from the pad. Oh, and this one has leaked through the back. Oh. Okay, Probably because I was pressing on it to make it yeah. go through. So I think that's my fault. We're going to see if it holds anymore if that keeps leaking to the back. If so, then... And this one, yeah, definitely dry all around the edges. No wing leakage at all. Okay, so I'm just yeah. pretending that... Because I, I was pushing on it to get it to seep through because it was taking a long time to seep through. So. Seven. All right, let's see after ten. How are they doing? Okay. Yeah. This one doesn't leak to the back at all. because I was pressing it, I think, so... This one's not leaking if I hold it up. This one's not leaking. And it actually feels pretty dry. This one feels pretty dry, and um, that's all me. Fifteen. Right, let's see how they're doing. This is after this fifteen. This one is pretty much fully oh. saturated. And this one has completely leaked to the back. So, this one didn't hold as much as I hoped it would. Okay, it's leaking off right here. That's when I put it on. It kind of leaked off there. It hasn't leaked through the back. This one has leaked to the back. And, like, when I push it, the water comes up. This one is the winner. Oh, don't worry. Is it really top cotton? Sorry. <laughs> All right, and they're about the same length and everything, so let's see how this goes. This is Microface backed with Pewa. One. Observes very quickly. Ten. So it's just that's ten. I spilt that there. But, um, so let's see how they're doing. No leaks. Feels really dry. Nothing leaking to the back on here, so we yep. seem all good. Let's continue on. So let's see how they do after 20. This one has no leaks. It's not dripping. Oh, this one is definitely Ooh. dripping off the edges there. And um, yeah, the middle of the back is kind of coming through a little. Yeah, that one's dripping off the wing. Oh, that one has definitely oh, leaked. Everything. <laughs> and this one is completely holding it all. So the winners are this gorgeous, I think it's so beautiful, recycle pad. Heavy. This disposal pad. But I just want you to notice that, unfortunately, they picked the poor uh, pads for the them because they really aren't usually that non -observant. We just picked the wrong pads for that component. It's just so thick that you could be wearing it, but it's very uncomfortable. Yeah, they're pretty much the same. But that one, that one did win. On fairness, kind of deformed. <laughs> um, this little low lily, who knows what it is. Little that one also won. <laughs> this one won. It's a lady pad. This pink lemonade shop cloth pad won. This pressure star pad won. <laughs> This party my pants. This adorable Looney Pads one. And this amazing on air flow pad one. So if you want, I'll leave the links. I mean I will leave the links down below to all these stores. If I can't leave the link to my Etsy store yet because it's not quite open yet. I'm still selling a few pads to put in my store. But that'll be open soon. So yeah, and thanks for watching and have a happy day. Bye!